Alright guys, it's Jenner back here with another video. Today's video is going to be on the MG34 Aggressive class. Today's class we have FFS Stubby Barrel, Tack Laser, No Stock, Stippled Grip Tape, and Commander Foregrip. This is a very aggressive class with kind of a high recoil, but mostly up close class setup. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video and the gameplay, drop a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications and never send the Call of Duty video. And also drop a comment to see what gun you guys want to see in the next video. No way, no way. That was the ultra quick scope. Whoa, that lag spike. Ice Canadian. Who's that? Oh my god. How? He, he quick scoped me? Like, he has that good of reaction time? I should have clicked again. I pressed the wrong button. I am so sorry, guys. That just happened. It is cracked at sniping. Wow. Runs out of ammo quick though and it reloads like, like seven seconds probably. I don't even know. But it takes a while. I wish I had a lot of ammo on this thing. I'd be spamming like crazy. I don't want to reload. I do not want to reload my back gun. It takes an eternity to reload. I'm going to sleep out this gun. No! I spawned right behind the dead. No. No. I want to get him in. Damage is real. Oh, it's a kid. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh 
Only seven bullets are still too quick. Oh, why is this kid spawned behind me? That's our content, bro. Do you guys think we should fix the shimmy spawns? Like, they need to be fixed. is literally just the recoil and the reload time that's pretty much it I mean let's go back and do the class again stubby bear helps with ADS and movement tack laser is just you know the old attack laser no stock helps with that movement and ADS stip will save the ADS spread the fire and then commando just you know just to help with the recoil a little bit but it does affect your movement speed so if you take that off and pin on like sleight of hand maybe that'll be a little bit better but you, you kind of want the commando for, you know, extra recoil help at range, but this gun overall, honestly, has to be one of the fastest killing LMGs, and the only down, yeah, that, uh, that's pretty much it, guys, like, I hope you guys like the video on the gun, and I hope you guys try it out, and if you do, comment down below, drop a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, and miss another Call of Duty video. I'm Jaranov, peace.